Way back in 1888, Trow and Holden uh, developed, designed, and manufactured the very first pneumatic carving tool. Uh, this particular one is number two. We're still looking for number one, so if you've got it, please call us and uh, maybe we can work a trade. Many things have changed over the years in these pneumatic tools. Many things have stayed the same. Some of the things that stayed the same are the uh, half inch shank in this particular one. Uh, the reliability and dependability of the tools, the craftsmanship and the pride that we have in making them and providing them is the same now as it was in 1888. Uh, whereas that particular tool was pretty much designed to fit everybody's needs, now as you can see we've expanded the line so that what your specific need is you probably can pick a specific tool to fulfill. Uh, we have two types of tools in the sense of power ranges. We have the, the, the B-type tool or the short stroke tool. We have the D-type tool, the long stroke tool. When we refer to the sizes, we talk about you know, half inch, three quarter, one inch, bantam, inch and a quarter machine. What we're referring to here is, is not the uh, the, uh, the, the amount of air or anything like that it takes, what we're referring to is the diameter of the piston that's inside each, each machine. Uh, the, the, the size of the piston has a direct bearing on how hard the machine hits. So if you're working with a, a smaller, delicate stone, stone that bruises, stone that sh shatters easily, or just stone that carves easily, chances are you'll be best fitted with one of the B-type tools or short stroke tools. Again, if you'd call us, we'll be happy to discuss which one of the short stroke tools or long stroke tools for harder stone would be best suited for your needs. Uh, they all are very air efficient. You're not, you're not required to have a very big compressor. Uh, usually in, in today's compressor world, generally a three and a half horsepower is, will provide you all the air and the power that you need uh, to run any one of these tools. The uh, short stroke tools or the B-type tools, again, come in three sizes. They all accept a half inch shank. As this is the aperture that it goes in. You simply slide it in there and it's ready to go. You control it. You have complete control over it. Uh, it's not retained in an artificial manner so that, so that when you're carving or sculpting, whatever you're doing, you can manipulate this chisel uh, and how you need to do it to, to achieve your results. The, uh, both the half inch B, three quarter B, one inch B, same with your long strokes, half inch, three quarter, one inch, all take that half inch, same half inch shank, which means that whatever chisel style or size you want, you can f interchange with amongst these tools. Generally speaking, the larger, the wider, the heavier chisel, the more work you're going to do, determines what size machine that you're going to pick. If you find yourself in a situation where you're doing just a lot of heavy work, a lot of uh, uh, real m grunt muscle type stuff, we offer the inch and a quarter machine. Again, remembering that the inch and a quarter refers to the diameter of the piston inside. It also is the one tool that takes a larger shank. It takes a 5 8 shank, fits the same way, works the same way, has tremendous power. The smallest tool that we make is the Berry Bantam. As you can see, it's a, it's a nine ounce machine. Uh, it runs extremely smooth. Uh, it's extremely adaptable to the smaller chisels. You can do really fine detail work with it. Uh, it's, it's just, a, it's just a, a wonderful little detail type carving machine. Although there are sculptors that will do the whole job with a machine this small. Each one of these tools comes with a lifetime guarantee against breakage. Uh, there's only one moving part. Maintenance is easy, as we've discussed in another clip. But let me reiterate that, that it's very important that you do the one thing that's required, and that's oil the machine on a regular basis. Ten weight white spindle oil applied here in the top of the tool. If at any time you have any questions regarding any of your tools, any of these tools, tools that you require, uh, for specific application, feel free to call 
and any one of us here at Trown Holden will be more than happy to, to spend whatever time we need with you to uh, pick the best tool for your job.